An international team of astronomers led by the University of Cambridge has discovered methane and carbon dioxide in the atmosphere of an exoplanet using data from the James Webb Space Telescope. The planet in question is K218b, a super-Earth, 8.6 times as massive as Earth, which orbits the red dwarf star K218, 110 light-years from the Sun, in the constellation Leo. K218b orbits within the so-called habitable zone of the star. This means that it moves around the star at just the right distance to allow liquid water to exist on its surface. It's the first time that carbon-based molecules have been discovered in the atmosphere of an exoplanet in the habitable zone. Earlier measurements of the atmosphere of K218b had been made in 2020 and 2021 by the same team of scientists using the Hubble Space Telescope. These measurements suggested that K218b belonged to a new class of exoplanets known as Hycean worlds, having ocean-covered surfaces beneath atmospheres rich in hydrogen. Such worlds, it was theorized, would be prime candidates in the search for extraterrestrial life. The results of the Hubble observations put this potential Hycean world high on the list for a follow-up study using the more powerful Webb telescope. Webb's higher resolution instruments have definitively identified methane and carbon dioxide in the hydrogen-rich atmosphere of K218b. The researchers also identified another weaker signal in the spectrum of K218b after several analyses, the researchers concluded that the signal could be caused by a substance called dimethyl sulfide, DMS. On Earth, DMS is produced naturally in only one way, by living things, mainly microbial life such as marine phytoplankton. The identification of DMS in the atmosphere of K218b is tentative. If more detailed observations confirm it, then we can begin to ask, does it point to biological activity on the exoplanet? One thing seems certain, we're learning more about a truly alien planet. A Hycean world unlike anything in the solar system. K218b is now high on the list of places where we might find early signs of life beyond the sun's domain.